them out a little. I'm bringing them in here. Teach me special little guys. What that was all about. See that? That right there gonna teach them. That when I come, but boy, I got some. I got some good loving around here. Yes, sir. Now that right there, that's vanilla milkshake. And a lot of other stuff I ain't gonna tell y'all. And I ain't got time to explain it. You do what you do, I do what I do. This is why mine do what they do. And I'm not here to just give you the food for one one. I'm just here to show you how to make them happy. It's the first time these guys ever had some. Some good in the face. Now I think I want to get some more puppies. Once we're ready to wean our puppies, or we just want our puppies to look healthy and fat like you see these other puppies in videos, we begin what we call independent feeding to teach them to become independent so we can help boost their healthy look. We begin to help the mother feed them as early as two days old. And they continue to feed on their mother. This is a part of that process. Uh, along with that process, this is also to get the puppies familiar with the family, with being around uh, different people, the sounds, the sights, the smell to enjoy the new environment with a good feeling of being in that new environment. It kind of helps with the mental uh, stability of those puppies uh, that'll grow into adult dogs that you see the stable dogs like Kodak and Quattro and other dogs that I mentioned. All puppies get love, so, you know, sometimes I have puppies like these three special puppies, one, three special people, and I want them all to feel that way. So, I have to, I have to give them all the same information. I'm programming them to all the same information. Basically, what I'm saying here is, sometimes I have eight puppies and three clients, or eight puppies and six clients that know where they want to go with their puppies and I don't want to just imprint half of the litter. I want to imprint the entire litter. I want to give them all that fighting chance to be dogs that can surpass any. So when you buy a puppy from us, you know that each one of those puppies got love. There was an, uh, one dog that got love and the other one did not. I look at it as the puppy that's left behind is the puppy that'll be my puppy forever or the puppy that'll be yours someday. some uh, medical issues with that one and I want to always make sure my clients are happy so I want to give Randy another dog This is a pack of Vanguardia Shepherds. These are blue Dutch Shepherds. Blue and purples. That's 
his first human season right there. They'll never forget that. And of course, they'll never forget who brought it to him. Daddy brought it to him. You want one of these puppies? You gotta get on the phone. Get on that waiting list. You done had enough. You gotta have enough. Everybody done had enough. Dutch Shepherds are pretty much the medium for me when it comes to Shepherds. Imagine someone loved German Shepherds and they say they're too laid back, but they are the laid back kind of dogs and then they can be that working machine. But more, more, more overall, they're a laid back type of dog in comparison to a Belgian Malinois. Some of the Belgian Malinois, if they don't come from the KMPV lines, kind of skittish, not really good dogs. Uh, but, you know, they're geared up all the time with just all the ways on the go. No real stop in them. So the Dutch Shepherd to me is the medium. A dog that is laid back like a German Shepherd clinging to his master, but can just turn up but has the heart of a lion. They are the ultimate dogs to me. These dogs can be family, friends, protectors, the kind of dog you see being very obedient in the store with someone who has a disability, but can go from zero to 100 in a split second and then come back to being that same humble mild-mannered dog that we just admired for being so obedient. Hey, Reese, we got to do this again, man. You know me, you know see, dog, you know I'm Grandmaster Von Amo, the world's greatest puppy in front of me. Turn that light up. For some of the world's greatest working puppies. If you want one of these great working puppies, don't hesitate. To dial 904 450 3339. These are Vanguard and Shepherds. Beautiful blue purple puppies. 60 to 70 generations of certified certificate KMPV Royal Dutch Police Dutch Shepherds. Then I bred them my way. So that they'll keep giving you that same genetic format in their working ability that you see in Kodak, that you see in Otis. That you've seen in She Devil, that you've seen in Quattro, that you've seen in Nero's One, Nero's Two, Nero's Three. These are those dogs. These are the dogs that guys like Lamar, Mike Scott, my boy Kira Reese, all of them guys, they bought dogs from me because this is where it starts. The imprinting, the love, the taking care of dogs until you guys come and get your new best friend. So what are you waiting for? Pick up the phone. Your new best friend is waiting.